Welcome back, everybody. Yeah, welcome back. Got something really special to me to play today. Something new and exciting. It's new and exciting for some, yes. Yeah. Uh, one of my favorite horror games of all times. Corpse Party. Corpse Partly. Corpse Partly. <laughs> Corpse Partly. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty neat looking game. It's existed forever. Yeah, it is an older one, yeah. It was... I think originally it was made as a college project or a high school project somebody made in the I think the very late 90s yeah it's been around for a while uh RPG maker game yep or wolf RPG one of those this is RPG maker I think initially when it was made <clears throat> yeah this is an update well actually I don't know but it was just PC 98 back then so maybe it was rebuilt could be yeah this is a, a more updated version of the game that just came out in the last like two or years I think two or three years yep uh, this is probably the, the best version of the game you can play i would say yeah because they had released the game on like the psp a while back and at one point it got ported into the ago. the ds i think the 3ds it was maybe yeah <clears throat> and now it's on the switch but yeah, i mean it's one that i've always wanted to play and i've never gotten around to playing it because and i've badged, too many games and i've badgered him to play it for years for a long time yeah it looks it looks really good though i know it's pretty pretty messed up um, so first off, config, message speed fast, all actually right away, effects. Oh. What? I can't have them all. I wonder if that's like a lighting effect. Can I have them all? Oh, maybe it's just over the screen or something. I don't know. This is, <clears throat> this was not in the PSP version. We're going to do candle. Playtime paint button. And for, oh my god, there's a lot. Initialize. That would just read, yeah. <coughs> Revert to default. My god. <coughs> Alright, I guess we'll do that. And then we go. Chapter 1. That's the only one I can do aside from the extra chapters. Let's do the extra <laughs> chapters right away. Definitely, probably not post game content. Chapter 1. New game. New game. New game? The newest game. Not too new of a game. But this version is. Mm -hmm. And we got our cute little doll friend down there to keep us feeling safe and not scared. No, not at all. I hear I should play this game with headphones. New chapter on opening. Yes. It is at its best with headphones because of the audio. Yes, I would like to view the chapter on opening. Why would I not? Sachi is my pride and joy. That's nice. Sachi sounds like they're a good person. Is Sachi a good person? She'd do anything for me. Hmm. So far, is this the same as when you played it? Or is this different? Um, I don't think she even recognizes me anymore. But I still love her with all my heart. This might have been, um, it has been a few years since I played the game. I hope the game is mostly the similar, like, just play-wise, instead of being turned into, like, a pure visual novel, like I know some of the later ones were. Uh, just Book of Shadows is. Yeah. Which, Book of Shadows is, it's more of, like, a point-and-click adventure, but that's still got some pretty heavy visual novel elements by nature. Yeah. It was a rainy evening after school, just like this one. I don't know, it's pretty sunny outside. Ah, uh, yes. Running down the stairs, the kindly teacher lost their foot, her footing. She tumbled and she fell and she died. Oh, that sucks. Sorry, teacher. You're, you've all heard stories. All have heard the stories, no? Before Kisaragi Academy was built here, there was another school on this property. Mm -hmm. Heavenly Host Elementary School, mm -hmm. it was called. Mm -hmm. Such a horrible thing happened. Ha such a horrible thing to happen. The principal was completely devastated. He cared for the school almost as if it were his own child, you see. But one thing led to another after the incident, and ultimately, a decision was reached. The school was to be shut down. The principal was so stricken with grief over losing his precious child that on the day of its closure, he climbed up to its roof and threw himself to his death. Or so the story goes. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's dark. <coughs> uh, that's the game in a nutshell, dark. <coughs> yep. Gasp. I'm sorry, I mean... <coughs> People thought Heavenly Host was cursed, you see. <clears throat> this is just the latest of many deaths to occur there. That's why it was torn down. However, they say the teacher who fell down the stairs still has no idea she's dead. Even to this very day. 
<laughs> and rainy <laughs> evening a like this, cheerily. after our school the day comes to an end, some claim she roams these darkened hallways, still believing them to be her own. In fact, it's almost time for her to make her rounds, just after 7 o'clock. That's when she appears, always accompanied by a sudden blackout that leaves the entire building dark as night. Yeah, they're trying to scare each other and have fun. Of course, it'd be pretty upbeat. Knock, knock. You hear from the blackness, <coughs> followed by the sound of the classroom door slowly sliding open. As her pale white face cuts through the stillness, her soft voice always echoes the same question. Is anyone still here? And then, crash, lightning. Yarg. Thanks, Satoshi. Good input. Wow, that was some pretty uh, perfect timing on the lightning. It's the blackout. Black Maybe she do it. What scare us like that? Jeez, Satoshi. But it was scary. Ooh, my little poopy baby. I don't like this. This shouldn't be happening. Not bad, Shinozaki. You had me going there for a minute. That Best character's almost right there, like Yoshiki in her. He looks <clears> like he should be like an adult almost, but then in like a child's body. <laughs> He's... <coughs> it wasn't me. I've been standing right here the, white, the whole forget. time. This is a real blackout. Blackout. At least it's not a brownout. <laughs> a rolling brownout. <laughs> no. Does anyone else hear that? But you... I, uh... Sounds like it's coming from the music room. I don't know, that guy looks pretty <coughs> cool. Mori Shige. Mori Shige? Yeah, he's pretty cool. He looks He's cool. got those cool glasses on and stuff, you know? Yeah. All present. Uh oh, pale face coming. <coughs> oh, there's a knocking at the door. No way. First the blackout, and now the door. And then the walls will ooze green slime! <laughs> oh, wait, they always do that. <laughs> Satoshi, quit being such a baby. What the hell is wrong with you, Satoshi? Get a hold of yourself and get off me. That's my chest. Yeah, come on, dude. Have some respect for the lady. Golly. More knocking. This is getting spooky. Told you it's a bad idea to stay here so late and tell ghost stories. Let me guess it's just past 7 p.m. Hey, Satoshi, aren't you going to get the door? What? Girls are all trembling in fear. Doesn't it just break your heart to see them like that? <laughs> yeah. So why don't you get the door? Well, it doesn't break my heart. That's cold, man. That's real cold. So I play as Satoshi. I play as the big crybaby. You are Satoshi, the main character. Well, I'm not going to get the door. I feel like there's got to be some secrets around here. Like all these desks and chairs. Oh, this door is the one they want. The knocking is from the other door. It, it certainly is, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I can't even walk between the desks. No, you're a thick boy. He is pretty thick. <clears throat> Look at that dumpy. Well, I guess there's nothing cool. Oh, wait. <laughs> Just hiding the closet. Overflowing with teaching implements at the highest pile. Like a keystone sits. The remote crystal for the overhead projector. Control. Remote control. <laughs> remote like, crystal. That's why I was confused. Are you good to read, man? No, not usually. <laughs> I never learned how to. <laughs> Anyone still here? Come home, children. Pale face gonna peek in. Yarg. Oh. Oh, Miss Shishido got him. Got him. Wait. <clears throat> Did her pale face scare them all? Miss Yui. I thought it was a different name. Oh, so she did the blackout. Oh, uh -huh, what a troll. She got him. <laughs> Good teamwork. I would also call that a rousing success. Good job, uh, Ayumi. I can't wait for you to mm -hmm. get skinned alive. <laughs> No, that, that, what? That won't happen to her. I wasn't a student here. She wasn't a student here. What? <laughs> I wasn't a student here too long ago myself, so when it comes to the seven wonders of Kisaragi High, I'm pretty well versed. Yeah, I can tell. You got seven wonders I'd like to check out. 
mainly all the stuff written in that piece of paper you have there. I thought Shig's reaction was priceless, but yours was on a whole different level altogether. Mochita. That's me, Mochita. Right? I'm well, just pretty Satoshi impressive. Mochita. I mean, he's still on his back, butt in the air, ready for a pound. <laughs> <laughs> he always has the best reaction. That's why we like Mochita. He's a scaredy cat. I just love when my scares are so thoroughly effective. It's simply delicious. Take your hands off. <laughs> delicious. <laughs> Let me eat that ass. <laughs> Whoever heard, whoever heard of a class representative with such a sadistic streak, anyway? Oh, was Ayumi a sadist? Maybe. Oh. Based on that. <laughs> I don't know if I like her. Hug. Satoshi's pretty cool. I like how scared he is. <laughs> yeah. All pranking aside, though, I ran into a more rather adorable... Arms. Yes. A individual <laughs> in the hallway who's come to see you. Is it a cat? Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. He's right here. Oh. Yeah, it would have been better if it was a cat. Who's Yuka? Yuka is his sister. sister. Oh, okay. Yes. <clears throat> oh, she's so happy. How cute. She what Cheetah forgot his umbrella this morning, so little Yuka here has come all the way to deliver it through the rain and the flames. Oh, yeah, I guess I did. Sorry about that, Yuka. Thanks. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. What a good little sis. <laughs> I see she is she from the junior high? Nice to meet you. My brother's always like this. A scaredy cat. Oh, <laughs> never mind. Always really kind, I mean. Yeah, that's what I meant. Aww. I had no idea you had such a cute little sister, Satoshi. Really? I never told you. Wait, why does he sound like a girl now? <laughs> really good question. You never said a word. You sure do love your big brother, don't you? Oh my god, so much exposition. I'll exposition you. <laughs> I sure do. Oh, ho. Oh, ho. Mmm, seems like she's met Keys she knew Ma before. Is that that's the, the white hair guy? Oh, hey Naomi. Looks like you've got yourself a rival, eh? Uh, I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. Like, oh my god. I swear, this mouth here says the craziest things. Shut up before I beat the snot out of you. <laughs> oh god, she's choking her out. <laughs> Alright, everybody, it's past seven. Isn't it about time you all got ready to head home? Yeah, until the doors are all locked leading out. Oh. Ooh. I'm getting tired. Can't Maybe relate. exposition, but this is important. Oh, I, I know. <laughs> so much. Aw, uh, do we have to? Shouldn't we clean up all the red bean cafe stuff first? It'd be a shame to leave so soon. So they're gonna eat all the food in the cafe. Yeah, the classroom like this, it almost seems like we could hold another culture fest tomorrow. We must have done something around like an anniversary of the school shutting down or something. No, you know school culture we... fest rules are just, you know, when they get together and set up like, uh, all the different classrooms are different things like haunted houses or shops and things like that. Yeah. <clears throat> At least that's what I've seen in my Japanese anime. <clears throat> Isn't that what you were supposed to be doing here in the first place? You promised me this room would be ready to go by the time I got here, as I recall. If she had to get mean. So that's her mean voice. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> well, it's getting late. How about you leave it for now and come in early tomorrow? Yes, ma'am. Yes, give me control again. I'm ready to play. Suzumoto, I know you have, I know how hard it is for you to say goodbye. <laughs> but I wish you the best of luck at your new school. I know you do just fine. Yeah, people's voices keep changing a lot. Don't even question it. It's a horror game. Thanks. Won't be the same around here without you, Suzumi. Well, it's fine. You can all stay together in death. I know you, Suzumoto. You'll make new friends in no time flat. I'm sure of it. And it's not like you're moving that far away. Come winter break, we'll all make sure to come visit. Yeah, totally. Don't look so glum. We'll see you again real soon. We're friends forever, after all. BFFs. You guys. Wah. Hey, brother, is that girl transferring to a new school or something? Brother. Yeah, today's Culture Fest was her last day. 
She's dying tomorrow. We're sacrificing her. Oh. She doesn't want to go to her new school. Thank you so much, all of you. I'm so grateful to have you as my friends. You all have a special place in my heart, and you always will. More like a special place in her fart. <laughs> Sniffle. I mean, <laughs> snork. <laughs> oh, Suzumi, take care out there. Ball, I'll always be watching you. I'm sorry, I mean, I'll always be watching over you from above. Why is she dying? Uh, <laughs> Seiko or Nah, Seiko. that's just how Seiko is. My spirit will guide your path. So she's gonna, like, astral project and watch her? Okay. Well, I think with that, we're gonna have to, uh, call it on this amazing episode of talking. Hey, it's important. It so. gets you to know the characters. Let's see that smile of oh yours, God. guys, and then uh, we'll we'll see y'all next time. Uh, if you like the video, if you like reading a book for 15 minutes or having it read to you, <laughs> um, hit that subscribe button. Um, we're gonna put this episode on Audible as an audio book. Heck yeah! <laughs> and then we'll see y'all next time. <laughs> Bye.